In this video, we will show you how to report in Vernon CMS. We will cover three things. An overview of the reporting tool, how to run an existing report template, and how to create a new report. To open the reporting tool, go to the toolbar and click the report button. If you have a window open, the reporting tool will report on that data file. If you don't have a window open, you will have to choose the data file to report on. The reporting window is broken into four sections. The first section shows you the type of report, listing, export, and word merge. Listing reports create PDFs. Export exports your data into CSV or text. Word merge uses Microsoft Word. The second section includes the fields in your report and record sorting. The third section has the formatting options for the report. The fourth section shows the records for your report. If you have a browse list open, Vernon CMS will report on those records. You can see how many records are selected here. If you don't have any records open, you can select the records here. If you see the words whole file, the report will have all of the records in that data file. You will often run a report using a saved template. To open a saved template, click the Open Report Format button. The portfolio window will open. Click on the report template and click OK. In this example, we've chosen a listing report. The reporting window will load all the fields and formatting the saved report template. To view your report, click the View button. Or to save the PDF, click the Output to File button. Choose a location and name your report. You can also make a new report. As with existing templates, it is useful to select your records before starting. Click the Report button on the toolbar and then choose the type of report. Listing reports have two options, group down the page and field across the page. Down the page has each field on a new line. Across the page reports look like a table. Click the field selection button. Double click the fields for your report from the left box. You can drag to reorder the fields in the box on the right. Click OK. You can use the same technique to sort your report by clicking the Sort Criteria button. Click the Format button to change the formatting of your report. For example, change the font, header and footer, page orientation, and add lines or page breaks. For listing down the page and word merge reports, you can add images. Tick the Images checkbox and then choose an image size. When you're happy with your formatting options, click OK. To view your report, click the View button, or to save the PDF, click the Output to File button. If you want to save your template for future use, click the Save Report Format button. This will open Portfolio. Give your template a name and click OK. Thanks for watching. We didn't cover word merge reports in this video. For more information on that, click the video link.